Namaskar. Today I am going to talk about a wonderful program of our Honorable Prime Minister, Prime Minister Kaushal Vikas Yojana, PMKVY. Uh, this scheme was approved by the Cabinet on 20th March 2015 and on 15th July 2015 it was implemented throughout the country. It has a very large outlay of about 12,000 crores and they are planning to train and develop the skill of our youth ranging in the age of 18 to 35 years. According to the World Bank report, the main reason for unemployment is a lack of skill. So our Honorable Prime Minister has devised this wonderful scheme. It is being implemented by the Ministry of Skill Development and Entrepreneurship. The Honorable Minister who is in charge of this wonderful program is Mr. Rajiv Pratap Dudi. This particular scheme is implemented through National Skill Development Corporation. There are uh, so far 527 training centers situated all over 27 states and uh, uh, about 40.5 lakhs uh, youth have been already trained and around 5 lakh youth are undergoing training in this wonderful program PMKVY. There are various types of training covered in this program. It is done through public private partnership. The government appoints training centers, authorized training centers to import training and to develop the skill of the youth. The very methods of training is first is short term training. Let us see what is short term training. It is meant for the people, the youth who do not have any skills, who do not have any prior knowledge about the skills to develop such youth, the short-term training courses are conducted uh, in the area of, uh, say, such as tailoring, carpentry, plumbing, electrician, uh, like this type of courses are there. And the period of the course is prescribed and it is uniform all over the India. The next type of training is called recognition of prior learning skill. In this recognition of prior learning, People, who are the youth who have already have some knowledge on tailoring, carpentry, plumbing, electrician, air condition maintenance, baking, food processing, who already have knowledge, who have already been working in uh, uh, unorganized sectors. Those people, they can go to the training center, they will be assessed about the present knowledge and then their skill will be enhanced through additional training. And after the training, they will be given certificate placement and other things are there. The third type of training is called special projects. Government bodies, government corporations are used to implement this particular special projects like secretary training, cabinet attendant, housekeeping, all this work related to office activities are being trained through these government bodies. As we have seen that these training programs are done through public-private partnership. Uh, this training for the development of the skill of the youth is done through authorized training centers. Any person can start a training center. But there are certain norms. You must have this much area of square feet. You must have a library, Wi-Fi facility, classroom, overhead projector, drinking water, air conditioning. All these norms are specified by the government according to the type of training to be imported by the training center. Once the training center fulfill all the conditions and they are impaneled, then it is their job to mobilize the youth to import training to them and also to ensure placement after the training by giving provided certificate. In some cases, they have to arrange loan through Mudra Bank also. So, you see, our Honorable Prime Minister has taken such a wonderful uh, scheme for the development of the youth of the country which will ensure overall development of our economy and finally this is having a wonderful monitoring skill the monitoring cell job is to ensure that the training centers are properly imparting training whether the students are attending classes regularly and there is no chance of duplicacy because every person who undergo training in this scheme must have a other card and there is no possibility of manipulation of numbers.
of those who are undergoing training in this PMKVY program. PMKVYofficial.org is the official website for this program. Anybody who is interested to undergo training has to apply online along with the Aadhaar card and uh, the, they will be alerted to the nearest training center for the type of skills they wish to get trained. And uh, we have to thank our Honorable Prime Minister for implementing this wonderful scheme. And his target is to train at least one crore youth by the year 2020. We hope we all will spread this message about this wonderful program to the deserving youth and make this program a grand success. Thank you very much.